I think it'd be fun to ask you about some big philosophical questions to see if you have an opinion on okay. them. <laughs> uh, do you think there's a free will or is free will uh, just an illusion? Well, I think classical mechanics would tell us that if we are, if we were to know every piece of information about a system and understand the rules which govern that system, we would be completely able to predict the future with complete accuracy. So if something could know everything about our lives, it could freeze time and and understand the position of every neuron in my mind about, about to fire, um, no decision could be uh, unpredictable. It, there, in some sense, there is that sort of uh, that sort of fate. I think that doesn't make the decisions we make illegitimate, even if some grand supercomputer could uh, understand what decisions we would make beforehand with complete certainty. I think we're making legitimate systems uh, within a system that has no freedom. We're making legitimate systems within a system that has no freedom. Can you explain what you mean by that? Yeah. So if we were to have uh, just a simple pendulum and I told you how long the, the rope was, I, I, we froze it at a particular um, point and I told you how high, ab- high above the ground the, the weight was and uh, you know, the motion of a, of a pendulum is something which is it's easy for everyone to imagine. Uh, I could... Uh, if we had all of that information, you could ask me, where will the, what will the pendulum do six and a half minutes from now? And we would have a, a precise answer. That's like a, that's an example of a very simple system with a very simple Lagrangian. Um, and we could completely predict the, the future. The, the pendulum has no ability to do anything uh, that would surprise us. Weirdly, that's true of whatever this... Uh, four-dimensional crazy world we live in uh, looks like if we were to if we were to understand where every piece of this system was at any given time and we we understand the the laws of motion how everything worked if we could compute all of that information somehow which we will never be able to do uh, we would uh, every decision you you will ever make could be predicted by that computer, that doesn't mean that your decisions are illegitimate. You are really making those decisions, but with a completely predictable outcome. So I'm just uh, sort of a little bit high at the moment on the uh, on this, on the poetry of a system within a system that has no freedom. So the human experience is the system we've created within the system that has no freedom, but that system that we've created has a feeling of freedom that to us ants feels as uh much more real than the the physics as we understand it of the underlying the like base system so it's almost like not important what the physics of the base system is that for the what we've created the nature of the human experience is uh there is a free will <laughs> or there is something that feels uh, close enough to a free will that it may not be uh, worth uh, spending too much time on the fact that it's, it's something of an illusion. We will never build a computer that knows everything about every piece of the universe at, at a given time. Uh, and so for all intensive purposes, uh, our decisions are up to us. We just happen to know that their outcomes could be predicted with enough information.